Hey everyone, I'm Nog and welcome back to Satisfactory. We are setting up our... Uh, what are they called? Truck stations over here and getting iron ore going. So we need to set up some miners over here. Actually, let's set them up this way. Uh, oops, wrong buttons. Wrong buttons don't help. And we need a merger. Uh, something like... Here, I guess. And then we need some... Like three belts there, and then we need mark four belts. We'll put on five, and those we need to come over and go into the truck station over here. And let's come this way. I'll clear out the uh, bushes that go through and stuff later. And have brush bushes going through the uh, conveyors that look stupid. And it annoys me. So that is a no go. Let's uh, come a little bit further this way. And then come over this way. And we need it to go in, so that's around here. And then come in. What's it encroaching? What the hell is it encroaching? What the? Oh, it's there that we want it okay the other one is the output so let's see let's come in up right off there and then come in there you get it nope there that should do it. Alright, and then we just need to hook them up with some power. I have actually pulled power over here. You can see the two miners over here are going full tilt and filling up on iron ore. So we need some power from... I guess we'll take it from this guy. And Place a pole over here. I really hope that one truck on each is enough, because else it could be a little bit chaotic. Having four trucks going with the uh, ore. But uh, we'll see. This can go there. This can go there. All right. So these guys are powering up, and oops, we have ore on both sides, and it's coming up. Standing. Now let's. On the clock, one of them a little bit, because we can only have two fifth or four fifty, isn't it? On the Mark Four belts, yeah, four fifty. So we can take take one of them down to two ten. Eight percent, maybe. Maybe seven. 88. All right, that's close enough. Save a little bit of power, and, and that's fine. And hopefully, 
900 extra iron ore a minute is gonna help. Let's just underclock this one as well. Oh, 188 is not a there. So, this should be all be going full tilt. And then we need to tell this guy where to go. I did get a little bit of coal. Hopefully that's enough to set up a path for him. Let's just back off a bit. This is the first time I, I drive one of these big boys, actually. So, uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. But let's uh, start recording and see how we do. Let's stop. And load up, and then we're going to go again. And we need to consider, okay, we're, we'll drive on the left side, that's fine, I can't see a thing. And we'll come over here, go. This is not easy. And we need to come up on this. Oh, come on, come on. And this guy will load and offload on the left side. I think. We need to put in more. Uh, Foundations there, that's a little bit too narrow, narrow for my liking. We can come in and offload and get some fuel, and then he'll go again. And actually, we'll set it up so that he drives on his on the on one side of the path and whoa and the other one will drive on the other side of the path man these things are not easy to drive Recording, hide path notes, enable autopilot, and exit. And how much does he have? Well, I didn't want to drive him, I just want to check this. Yeah, it's quite a bit. And off he goes. Our very first truck in service. Let's just see how it does. Follow him here. Ooh. Ho -ho. What are you doing, buddy? <laughs> He's not doing that great. But he is getting there. There we go. Jesus. I think these guys are gonna have a bit of trouble. They're big vehicles. But he's he makes it? Mm. 
I made it. And this is now getting full. I'm standing. Does he have any left in here? It's going there. He's full on fuel. I already set that up in between episodes. So we have coal coming over here. Uh, which is uh, taking a toll on our coal, but uh, we'll deal with that for now. Uh, let's see, I think I want to get rid of this tree. There we go. And not have that thing in the hand because it's loud. So we don't need to have anything in our hand right now. And it's not. And just put those two in. Makes me feel a little bit more safe. Alright. So he is up at the other end now. So let's uh, build a truck here. And get some fuel in it. Oh, it's getting fuel. I think. Yes, it is. Let's drive it. And start recording. And we'll come in here. Ding. Offload and turn around. And hopefully get to the ore and back again without ramming into the other truck. Whoa! That is so insane, that jump. Come down here. And... Going... Whoa, 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 whoa. Here comes the other truck. Let's see, do we have show path loads? Would like to see those. Come up here. And load. And get going again. And go back. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is so dangerous. But it's fun. But these trucks are crazy to drive. Not a fun to drive, but crazy to drive. And, and it's insane. Okay. Can you please move? And we move. What are you doing? <laughs> okay. What is he doing? We're gonna need to clear the path and try this again. Okay, start recording. There we go. Let's hope that it works better this time. I guess they don't like backing up or something. For some reason. Okay. So let's go. What's he 
doing? What the hell is he doing? Okay, back up. What is the other guy doing? This does not seem to be working. But we're gonna finish this path first and then we'll go take a look at the other guy. I guess they don't like backing up, so how can we do this instead then? Hmm. Basically, it seems like they need a, like a drive-through. So they just come in, stop, and move on out, out the same direction. Hmm. Suppose we could do that. It would need some reconfiguration, but I think it's possible. And see, finish recording, hide path nodes, and get out. Is he not an auto autopilot? Enable autopilot. There we go. So weird. I did not tell him to go forward there. I tell him told him to back up. Okay, the trucks do not like backing up. Whoa! Where are you going? This, um, this isn't working. Let's delete him. Let him offload. And delete him. Let's see what's in there. A lot. Don't need those. We don't need those. We don't need those. Um, let's just grab some of this. See, I guess it won't fit in here. Will it fit in here? Some of it will. It's a bit of a shame. I'm gonna have to delete some of that stuff. There's what it is. There's plenty where it came from. we don't want to delete is this stuff. We don't really want to delete the coal either. So let's just delete the ore. There. Okay, so we need to do some sort of different setup. I'm thinking that what we could do is line them up over here. Have the trucks come in here. Or maybe li line, li line them up over here. Have the trucks come in over here. And then go around here somehow. around like this and come into into the path here I think that'll work let's um, let's give it a shot we are going to need a crap ton of storage because these things <laughs> are full of iron um, you know what let's Whoa! I did not want to fall down here. How do I get back up? Darn it. Okay. Here we are. So I think what we're gonna do is 
set up some storage containers here. And they're big. Jesus. Okay. And then we will get our iron ore going out and into those buffer chests. And we need... Uh, let's see. Where can this... Where does that work? I think that works. And we need two of them. You come in there. And then we need another one over here. Something like that. And you come in there. And go over. Man, I really thought this was going to work. Let's see. Variable is too long. So let's build a couple of poles here. And get the belt over. That's fine. And over to the other side. Oh, I put them the wrong way around. Let's just fix that. Uh, input. And get those offloaded. Alright, so they're filling up with uh, iron ore now. And then we'll figure out how we're going to get over and up afterward. We need to clean this up as well. It just looks like crap. I mean, it's so messy over here with all the belts and stuff. We can do that much nicer somehow, I'm sure. Oh, so we're gonna. Uh, I just need to figure out how. But we're definitely gonna do that. Uh, okay, so... Those are getting done now. floating as fast as they can very good which means that we can start building the foundations for a road around here Alright, so should we make it four wide or three wide? Three, four, three wide should be enough. It is a long way down, but I guess we can put some walls up as a bit of protection for that, from, from the rocks falling down. Go. All right, so we are going to lay these foundations and get the road connected to the other road. And then I guess we need to go up here. Um, 
think we need to go up twice actually. And then we will get uh, try out our trucks one more time because they were fun and I like them and uh, I just want them to behave. But of course, if something behaves, it's not as fun as when it disbehaves. Am I okay with that sand there? I am not sure. I don't think I am. I don't think I am. So, go up one more. Actually, let's do it like this. Uh, foundations. I want you on eight and you on seven. And then we'll go up. Eight. Oh. Okay, so this needs to be moved back one. That's okay. And then. Uh, that it will get up here, yeah. And seven. What we also could do is just make the whole thing a little bit less steep. That might be worth it. So do the same process here, back to here. So that it doesn't have this steep incline. I think that might be worth it. Uh, and let's not have it go down again directly. We can just hook it up di directly over there, actually. That will work. And then this will actually act as a wall for these guys. Which isn't a bad thing. So, he's in the way. Alright. So I think uh, I will uh, get all of this road done. And then uh, in the next episode, we will give it another try with, uh, with the trucks. Because we need that iron ore coming in. And the trucks are fun. So... Yeah, that is what we are going to do. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and maybe subscribe. And I will see you next time.